What's up, YouTube? This is Rich Private with Kellon. Uh, it's Memorial Day, and uh, first of all, I like to, as a veteran myself, I like to uh, say thanks to all the guys who have uh, volunteered or were drafted into the service, and uh, you know, you did your thing, and you 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 honored your country. So, kudos to you guys. Uh, also, uh, this. Yeah, I am on Memorial Day. Uh, should be taking it easy, but I thought the old fleet could use a little cleanup, so I'm out getting it all cleaned up, washing them down, getting them ready for the upcoming uh, week. Um, you know, I've just been thinking, uh, you know, over the years, I've been uh, fortunate, blessed enough to even have uh, some things, when it comes to some things that have been taken from me. But it looked like every time that happened, Yahweh blessed me in a way that I could uh, even better the fleet uh, with some better equipment. And uh, I just thank him for that. But anyway, here I am, you know, just uh, doing my thing. Nice, cool day. Eh, got a little warm. Not not real bad, though. Uh, I'm, I'm in the shade. It's kind of, you know, relaxing, really, uh, doing what I'm doing right now. Because, uh, I mean, uh, ain't nothing like taking care of your equipment. Making sure it's uh, in good shape. And that's what I'm doing here. So when you guys you get a chance, maybe not on your holiday you know, on the day off, because it's good to go ahead and take a break and relax and recharge yourself, but make sure you're out there taking care of your equipment. Take the time to clean it up, uh, because a lot of times dirt hides a lot of things that can be wrong with your equipment. Uh, and it also can cause a lot of things to go wrong with your equipment. So as long as you can Keep them clean and, uh, and take a good look over them. You know, you may catch something that you uh, may not would have, uh, may not have seen, being that they're all dirty. But uh, it's just also it just looks good when you pull up to somebody's home and you pull your equipment off the uh, your trailer or off the truck. That have you know the equipment is uh, looking decent. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, this business, it get dirty. You know, it's dusty and dirt. But uh, we can still uh, take the time to try to keep our stuff uh, clean so that it helps the equipment. Also, it presents you uh, as a person who cares about what you're doing. And uh, whether you know it or not, people do take... Uh, they'll be looking at what you... What you cut in the yard with. Now, they can care less, but uh, when it looks clean, I think they do give you the upper hand sometimes. But anyway, um, here I am doing my thing once again, like I say, clean the old Pro Turn 252 and the Bradley and the Pro Stance, uh, two, uh, uh, Pro Stance 32 inch. And I got my trimmers and stuff up on the ramp there and we'll clean them as well and I, I was going to try to do this video in a little bit more detail but uh, I, I got a, uh, a little tip from uh, Blade of Grass and he was uh, talking about this uh, particular soap he used or cleanser he used purple and uh I've been using it, and it works wonders. You'd be surprised how uh, easy the stuff comes off when you use this product. So if you get a chance to go ahead and pick you up some of that purple, man, do it. It's worth the, it's worth the money. And, uh, and cause, uh, keep you from having to do a lot of scrubbing. It really does. So anyway, go ahead and uh, want to stop talking here.
and let you go ahead and enjoy the rest of the video. Oh, I like to say this: Will you please like? Will you please subscribe? Will you please share? Hit the notification button, and uh, you know, I really would appreciate it, especially you guys. I I want to try to get another 200 on the old subscription, so I can head towards that. Uh, halfway mark to to a thousand subscribers but uh you know really would appreciate you if you're watching just take the time to subscribe uh like I, like i said like and share and always i ask that you comment let me know what you think you know if you got an idea that i can do something better i'm always willing to listen and with that as always enjoy the mold Stuff by itself, um, and then once you get through, you can just kind of like rinse it off. 